tease tape and contact auger fungal sampling. Tease tape on to a slide. Place a 3M clear scotch tape onto the surface to be sampled and then place the tape directly onto a microscope slide. It's often better to have a frosted edge on the end of the microscope slide so it can be labeled. When looking at the slide underneath the microscope I use mounting fluid. You can use just clear 85 percent lactic acid. In this case you've used some acid fusion that works fairly well. Use a very dilute amount, not as much as generally prescribed, and then place the tape back over onto the slide. And if you noticed, the tape extends over the edge of the microscope slide. So peel that off so it doesn't get caught when moving the microscope slide around the microscope stage. These are the fungal spores under 100x power. Now we've going to move it up to 400x and the fungal spores are much larger. The tape can also be done inside a plastic resealable bag. This works out very well if you don't have a microscope slide and you want to transfer it. Press the tape down onto a surface then place it inside a Ziploc bag. The analysis is done just the same when you get to the lab and you can put it on a microscope slide. Contact auger sampling is often used on surfaces for culturable fungi. Press the auger plate down onto the surface. Don't press too hard or the auger will be left behind. But press firmly enough so that you see some indentation on the auger plate. Take a Rodak plate sample, take the lid off, press the auger directly onto the surface, rolling it evenly, turn it back over, put the lid back on. To keep the plate from being contaminated by other cultures, you can place tape around the edge or perimeter of the plate, typically only a small piece of tape is used on one edge and then on the opposite edge to keep the cover onto the auger. In this method, or the method that I'm showing, it's a lot less likely for contamination to occur than the other method. The auger side of the plate is labeled with information noting the date and location. Do not place this information on top of the cover as it can be detached from the auger. Aspergillus niger under 40x power. The contact auger plate is placed directly on the microscope stage with lighting at approximately 30 to 45 degree angle. This gives a nice 3D effect of the Aspergillus niger heads seen here looking through the microscope. Thank you very much and I hope you enjoyed the show.